Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Sorry if that shook a little bit. Today I have for you a new type of video that I'm going to, hopefully this works out well. The quality probably isn't the greatest because I am using my webcam and a screen recorder to do this video, but I thought it would be um, the best this way. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to show you how to reprint extra bucks and CRTs. Now this won't work for instant coupons, but it will work um, this way. So what you're going to do is you're going to want to be in Google Chrome. Now I have a Mac computer um, and I always had issues using Safari which is Mac's um, internet browser. So you're going to want to be in at least Google Chrome for this um, for this to work. So then the next thing, of course you can see, I am signed in to my CVS account. So of course you're going to want to be in your CVS account. So what we're going to do is we're going to scroll down to our extra bucks. I know I don't have a lot of extra bucks. I know some people have over a hundred dollars every week, um, but that's just not how I do it. Um, and that's just so that my out of pocket is much lower. But anyways, so what we're going to do is we're going to go to this $10 extra buck right here and you're going to want to take your arrow and it turns into a little hand for me and you're going to click that. Now it's going to say redeem in store or online but then it's going to say here um, sequence number and this is a very important number that you need. So you're going to want to drag and highlight that number and you're going to want to copy that number. Now I got this tip from um, an Instagram user many, many months ago. I think her name is Heart0407. Um, um, she had she did change her name because a lot of people were getting their Instagrams deleted. Um, so I do believe that is her Instagram name now. So anyways, we're going to go to my notepad here. And this right here is the address or the link that you need to have in your account. So I am going to leave this up for a minute and just kind of babble to you so that you can write this down. It is um, what you're going to need for both um, extra bucks and CRTs. Now, I was always told, and I will get to that a little bit more in depth, that if you sent a CRT to your card, you would not be able to reprint it. But I did try it because I did film this once before, and um, there was a little bit of a um, technical issue. And so, um, yeah, I had to... But yeah, anyways, so that is the link there. I can also put it in the description box down below if that is more helpful to you. So you can just copy and paste it instead of write down this big long number. So this is what you're going to need. You're going to want to have it in your computer. Now I am not trying this on a phone so or a tablet, so I cannot speak for that part. So anyways, we're going to go back to our browser and no, we're not. We're going to go back here and we're going to go to the end here where the equal sign is and we're going to paste that sequence number there. Then you're going to copy this whole thing and then you're going to go back to your browser. What you're going to do is you're going to open a new tab and it is very important, of course, that you are already signed into your CVS account. If you are not and you copy and paste this in a new tab, it won't show up. So it's a very finicky trick, but to do it this way it works for me every single time. So I'm just going to copy and paste it, and then I'm going to hit enter. And there pops up my extra bug. And I just go here to print, and then here is my little screen here to print it, and I can print this again. I'm not going to print it because... Um, I, of course, I don't need to. And then it will print out on a full sheet like this, and it'll be big. Um, but you just cut around this gray line here and hand it to your cashier, and everything will work out just fine. So then we're just going to cancel that. Now, if um, you copy and paste that and you're not signed in or something doesn't work right, none of this here will show up. The little CVS symbol here will show up possibly the print symbol or this close here, but that is it. Nothing else will show up, and if you hit print, nothing will print. So you've got to make sure that this shows up on screen. 
So we're just going to close that out. And that is how you reprint an extra buck that you have lost. Or say if you, you do a transaction and one, this happens to me quite frequently. I overestimate how many extra bucks to give them um, or something is cheaper and then I end up, um, one's not applied because I'm already at that zero mark for my transaction. So it'll say down at the bottom of your receipt, it'll say something wasn't used, but it doesn't say which one. So you can try to go through with your cashier if you want, or you can just say, you know what, it's fine. It shows up on my app and I'll just reprint it later. And I do that sometimes too. So anyways, then we're going to go down to CRTs. So down here on CRTs, I've always been told that if you have a CRT that you sent to your card, you will not be able to reprint it. Now here it just says print it or reprint. And of course, hit reprint and there is your CRT that you can reprint like that. Um, or um, if you haven't printed it yet and you didn't send it to your card, right here on a reprint and printed, one should say print and one should say send a card. And that should be it. Sometimes it only says send a card, but that's totally fine. The only thing you need is the sequence number. So you're going to have that copied like we just did. You're going to go down to, you know, wherever you have the link copied. I keep it in a notepad um, and then I use Google Docs. I don't use the Word, the Apple's version of the Word program here on this thingamajig. So then we're just going to copy that or paste it. Then we're going to copy the whole thing again. And then we're going to go and open a new tab. I open a new tab every time just for personal preference. And then you're going to paste it and hit enter. And there shows up your um, CRT. All you need is that sequence number. Now, if I go here to this one, this paparazzi one, this is the only one that I have left that I haven't printed, but I sent to my card because I didn't do the deal yet. Um, I go to show details, I go to the sequence number, and like I said before, I've always been told that if you have a card or if you have a CRT that you sent to your card, you cannot print it. Um, but I tried this earlier today and I didn't print it yet. Uh, I don't know why I hit enter there, but we're just going to copy that. And then we're going to go back. I'm going to open a new tab and I'm going to paste it and hit enter. And my cat's peeking in the window. And now I have my CRT and I'm going to actually print it out. And you're going to hear the printer go. But uh, yeah, I'm going to print that out. And that is it, guys. That is how you can print your CRTs. It is very important that you have that link copied down correctly and that you follow the steps correctly and that you get that sequence number in there correctly as well. And my cat, I just let him out. He likes to go outside, uh, but he come around to back to the door promptly to like let me know that uh, he needs to be let in. But anyways, guys, that is all I have for that, I know so a few people actually asked me that yesterday. I said I would put out a little video today, and I hope this is helpful. Of course, if you have any questions, please let me know. And let me know what you think of the whole webcam screen capture thing. Do you like that, or do you just want to see the screen? It doesn't matter to me. But anyways, guys, thank you so much for watching. I hope you have a great day, and I will see you guys later. Bye.